If you are looking for a place to hang out, especially for some Pahana Fridays, maybe a nice dinner date, then Brood in Kaimuki is a place that you need to check out. And today I'm talking with Kristen, co-owner, to tell us all about Brood. Um, I'm super excited to be here. Thanks, thanks so much for coming in. We're excited to have you guys. So let's tell our viewers a little bit about Brood because this is the first time that I'm in here. So what I love about Brood is it kind of hits all areas, whatever you're looking for, whether you're looking for a quaint date night, uh, Pauhana with friends, doing something to celebrate, whether it's a friend's birthday, it's great for small groups, big groups, um, and we actually allow dogs as long as they're on leash. So it's also dog friendly, which is really neat and unique, I think, to a lot of uh, other restaurants around. You get that sense of cozy, comfortable vibe, of, which, you know, obviously is everything that we live for being in the islands. <laughs> Absolutely. Yeah. All right, let's talk about the menu. What are some popular dishes that our viewers can look forward to? So we really pride ourselves in having a good variety for every type of diet, um, whether it's vegan, uh, vegetarian, or our meat lovers. So um, some of our popular items are the brood burger. It's a huge hunk of meat, lots of piled uh, accoutrements on top, and uh, real juicy, cook to order, how you like it. But on the other end, we also have a Beyond Beef Burger. So for those who are not looking to eat meat and prefer something a little different, we have that option for them. One of my personal favorites is the Szechuan cauliflower. So it's a great appetizer either to hoard to yourself or to share with the group, but it has a lot of uh, kick to it and crunch. Great flavor. I love that. Now, we have a lot of viewers actually, and surprised that I'm surprised, that a lot of them are either trying to get into the vegetarian plant-based diet, and you have a full menu just for them, right? Absolutely. So it's mixed into our small and large plates, um, but you can find something for everyone here, and we're always happy to make modifications if needed. Right. She was talking about a mac and cheese earlier, so you can either have that with or without meat. So you get it all here at Brood. Absolutely. <laughs> now we're here in beautiful Kaimaki. Just tell us real quick why you think this is such a great area for your business. So. I love Kaimuki. Um, I'm not from Hawaii, but when I relocated here, I could just feel the energy uh, all around. There's so many great local businesses and such a sense of community when you come around here. Everyone's looking to support local, support the Hawaiian economy, and looking out for each other. So it's such a close-knit neighborhood where everyone's looking to help each other out and give a shout out to their neighbor or support them in some way or another. Now the other side of food, we're gonna be talking about drinks, so stay with us because Kristen is gonna take us behind the bar to talk about some beer. I'm excited. <laughs> Very nice. It's a nice place. Mm -hmm. And Kaimaki, it's, that's where I grew up. Uh, it's a great place. Um, and that looks like it's going to be a great atmosphere for folks that want to go in and enjoy. So Definitely. And the food is really good. They have, I always, when I go, get the deep fried pickles. Deep, deep, deep fried, fried pickles. pickles. The fried pickles <laughs> are bomb. That plus a beer, can't go wrong. <laughs> oh, so it's yeah. a good spot yeah. though. Super cute. They have some outdoor seating area as well. So it's a great place to go for maybe a little pauhana or hey, to celebrate National Beer Day. 